We are broadcasting live from the Thunderdome in Cineraplis, Forsk, Minnesota. And the Mutant Eaters have a proud history in the MFL of winning just about everything but the really big game that matters. And maybe that's why they have the same exact number of bars and churches. Hey, shut up and pass the tater tots, huh? Both teams hit the field ready to hit each other in this MFL matchup. The Mile High Chronic take on the Purple Mutant Eaters. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man. How's Kevin with Simo? I am with him and I'm Simo. Yeah, we got you in the championship. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Damn, and these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he breaks away. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. <laughs> First down and nine. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey skin wrapping on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoffs. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Hey. And he's off to the races. They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a sawbuck riding on this asshole. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. hot. Oh, with the punishing hit. Third down and six. Now this one's gonna be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type though, a little too mute. He's got the distance and the kick is good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first.
first and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. Two yards on the pass. Then this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. Third down and eight. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and eight. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Second down and a very lot. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. Third down and eight. Well, I want Sean Kick and make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on MFL Game Day. Uh, MFL isn't episodic, Brent. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He's gonna be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. That's a catch for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell run for a yard. Third down and five. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Hot, 
Hunt one, hunt two, hunt... Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. First down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. for the touchdown. When skeletons make it to the end zone in one piece, that's always cause for celebration. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The chain's moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And that's a pass that went nowhere. God, it's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth. What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Oh, nice hit! And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Third down and the punter is warming up. Oh, what the brutal hit. Two minutes remain in the half. Great. I got to take a dump. And they'll line up for the punt here. Oh, no good. Well, that punter's going to find a cut. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw... And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Six-yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog... They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. 
And quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so good. Well, that play didn't work. They'll have to rethink that. Second down and ten. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. First down. And it's for a timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the points and let's move on. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> the second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, I'm gonna go to a strip tea show. Where we going? Greatest, greatest. Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Well, come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. 
Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down in a mile. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. I'm the junior. No, you I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> They're going for two points. And they run it in for two points. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. hot. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and long. Hot, hot one, three. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he held on to that one for a first down. First down of seven. And he gets three yards on that run. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And that's just a great run for a touchdown. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond.
And it's first and ten. Boom! Second down in a lot. Got crushed. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was. Second down and nine. man you see that that's right you can't handle this you can't handle what i got yeah get the hell out of here man third down and the offense needs a miracle three comes to an end but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter you know sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back a misfired punt will give the opposing team great field position they let the punt drop and it will be down by the defense And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. And they run it for a couple of yards. Oh. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds. Me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. Hot. And that is unfortunate. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer. And it's first and ten. Hot. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Third down and eight. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. A great throw and a great catch, but sadly to the wrong team. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a cop I was at home. And it's first and ten. game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. 
third and two. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can see that, Graham. Oh, boy. And it's first and ten. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Third down and long. Starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all you can eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. hot. It's about a three-yard pickup. Now why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pitchkin? I'm hungry for bacon! Hot two! Three. This guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one! Let's see if they can get the return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, with the brutal hit! And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. <laughs> Second down, and that's the last timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant? Mortality? Of that's constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them, time out, stop our own. And he just slipped in like bricks and bowels. He is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. <laughs> First and eight to go. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he's running like a moose right and picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He 
Let me fight him, kick him next time. The Purple Mutant Eaters are nothing but blue today, taking a home loss. Uh, does that mean they'll eat a different color? Am I sent to ask them for autographs, Grim? What color eats what, Grim? The opposition came into town and stole one from them. It's a bitter one-point loss. Just like a thief in the night. They should go to jail. Stealing ain't right, Grim. Let's listen to what the game's most valuable player has to say about it. Why? The guy's got the intelligence of a horseshoe. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.